What exactly is Manifest V3? Well, it's an update to Chrome's extension platform, and while it's designed to boost security and performance, it's bad news for ad blockers like uBlock Origin. The main change? Well, Manifest V3 limits how extensions handle web requests. Before, uBlock Origin used the web request API to block ads before they even had a chance to load. Now, with this new declarative net request API, ad blockers are restricted to predefined roles, making them far less effective. Effective. And that subtle yet important change means uBlock Origin won't be able to dynamically block content like it used to. You've probably seen the warnings on Chrome's web store that say it may no longer be supported. And the sad reality is, this affects how well it can protect you from those ads, and as a result, you'll likely start to see pop-ups and banners while you're browsing. And it's not just uBlock Origin. Other popular ad blockers like AdGuard and Ghostery are facing very similar limitations. Even Brave's built-in ad blocker is feeling the squeeze, though those platforms are working on workarounds to adapt to these new rules. If you're tired of dealing with browser limitations, a VPN-based ad blocker like PIA Mace could be a game changer for you. I say that because unlike browser-based blockers, PIA Mace works by blocking access to servers where ads and trackers live. This means no matter which browser you decide to use, PIA's ad blocker is effective across the board. We ran some tests and here's what we found. Before enabling PIA's ad blocker, only 7% of ad hosts were blocked. But once we turned Mace on, that number jumped to 93%. And it didn't matter whether we were using the standalone app or the browser extension, the results were consistent throughout. If you want a deeper look into PAA, or private internet access, and its ad blocking capabilities, you can check out our latest review here. So to wrap things up, Chrome's Manifest V3 is shaking up the ad blocker world, especially for uBlock Origin users. But as we've covered, you've still got plenty of options. You can switch to Firefox to keep using uBlock Origin at full power, try uBlock Origin Lite on Chrome, or explore other browsers like Brave or Vivaldi that are still supporting the old ad blocking system. And if you want a more powerful browser independent solution, VPN based ad blockers like PAA's Mace are a fantastic option as well. It blocks ads at the network level, making it a true cross-platform solution. If you enjoyed this video and want to help support the channel, then check out the links down in the description box below. It's your support that helps us continue creating helpful content just like this video, plus we can get you a flat discount on annual subscriptions. Whatever you choose, don't let these changes ruin your browsing experience. Try out some of these solutions and stay one step ahead of these changes. If you found this video to be helpful, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe, and let's keep your online life secure and ad-free. We'll see you in the next video.